Big changes are coming to the Pi Network. The Pi Core team just announced a major update to the Pi Network's blockchain and node system, signaling a new era for decentralization and rewards. If you're a Pi Network pioneer, or just curious about the future of this innovative cryptocurrency, you won't want to miss this update. Welcome back to our channel, Pi Network Enthusiasts. Today we're diving into the latest and greatest update from the Pi Core team. They've officially announced a significant transition for the Pi Network's blockchain and node system. Currently, the Pi Network is running on the main net, but it's managed by only three nodes controlled by the core team. With over 300,000 user-operated nodes still on the testnet, this new update will start selecting and approving eligible nodes to transition to the mainnet. This is a huge step towards making the Pi Network truly decentralized. Before we get into all the exciting details, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Your support helps us bring you the latest updates and news about the Pi Network and other exciting projects. Also, please note that this video is for entertainment purposes only and is not intended as investment advice. Always do your own research before making any financial decisions. Now, let's break down what this update means for the Pi Network and how it could impact you as a pioneer. Stay tuned! The Pi Core team has officially announced an upcoming update to the Pi Network blockchain's Pi Node technology. Currently, the Pi Network is running on the mainnet, but it is administered by only three nodes overseen by the Pi Core team. Meanwhile, more than 300,000 user-operated nodes are still active on the testnet. With this upgrade, the Pi Core team will begin choosing and approving qualified nodes to join the mainnet. This breakthrough is essential because the Pi Network's blockchain node architecture must be operational on the mainnet before it can completely launch. This is necessary for the Pi Network's blockchain to be truly decentralized. Congratulations to all of the pioneers who believed in the initiative and invested in the necessary equipment to run Pi Network nodes. Until now, running nodes on the testnet received merely acceleration points. However, once accepted for the main A, these nodes will receive daily Pi payments based on the number of transactions they facilitate. The following table shows the transaction fees that wallets must pay while conducting blockchain transactions. These Pi coins will be distributed to nodes that run the Pi network blockchain in order to keep the system operational. Naturally, the more Pi currencies exchanged on the blockchain each day, the more incentives the nodes receive. This blockchain is special in that each node must be linked to a Pi Network account and pass KYC, Know Your Customer Authentication, implying that each user can only have one node account. This differs from Bitcoin, which allows anybody to establish and run as many nodes as they like, resulting in the dominance of large Bitcoin mining firms. This issue, which threatens Bitcoin's decentralization, is efficiently solved by the Pi Network. Understanding the Pi Network blockchain's functionality is critical for determining the project's value. Here's the most recent update on the Pi Network blockchain which pioneers should be aware of every day. Many pioneers join the Pi Network just for the Pi coin price and how to sell the coins they've mined, without knowing the blockchain's mechanics. This lack of understanding frequently leads to a lack of trust and an underestimating of the Pi Network initiative. Blockchain statistics expose everything that occurs within the Pi Network ecosystem. If you truly appreciate the Pi Network, we invite you to learn about the blockchain, specifically the Pi Network blockchain. Draw your own conclusions based on the Pi Network blockchain statistics presented here. Currently, 5,724,380 accounts have been transferred to the main net, together with 3.44 billion Pi coins. However, 2.5 billion Pi coins have been frozen, leaving only 500 million in circulation. When we reach the open mainnet phase, we'll have the option to lock 200% of Pi coins to boost mining speed. As a result, the circulating supply of Pi coins will be less than some anti-Pi critics had predicted. Many pioneers may be unaware of this and believe that the market for 100 billion Pi coins is excessive. The Pi Core team has also updated the Pi Wallet to the most recent blockchain version. If you visit Pi Explorer today, you will not see the total number of Pi coins, like in the prior version. Continuous modifications are being made to welcome Pi today. The following is the current list of the top 10 wallets with the most Pi coins. The top wallet holds 24 million Pi coins, while the 10th largest holds 338,000 Pi coins. You may believe you have a small number of Pi coins, but in actuality, the system's 4.42 million wallets contain fewer than 10. Wallets containing more than 1,000 Pi coins are uncommon, accounting for only 2% of the total. 
there aren't as many Pi coins as you may expect. What are the Pi network nodes? Nodes are the fourth role in the Pi ecosystem and run on laptops and desktops instead of mobile phones. Similar to other blockchains, Pi nodes will be responsible for validating transactions on a distributed ledger and resolving the challenges in maintaining a distributed currency by having all nodes come to a consensus on the order of new transactions that are being recorded. Unlike nodes that use proof of work such as Bitcoin or Ethereum, Pi node uses a different consensus algorithm based on the Stellar Consensus Protocol, SCP. In SCP, nodes form trusted groups, quorum slices, and only agree to transactions that those trusted nodes agree to. Nodes and mobile apps are not mutually exclusive but complementary to each other. You will log into the node software through your mobile app account, which means both desktop and mobile apps are pointing to the same Pi account. As Pi policy, one person will only be allowed to have one Pi account, and as of now, one account should run only one node. Mobile mining can only be started from the mobile app, while the desktop Pi app interface of the node will allow you to check balances, chat, and watch any media content on the home screen. Whether an account has a node or not, does not affect any functionality in the mobile app. One of the goals of Pi's testnet is to determine what, if any, rewards there should be for running a node. While the Pi Network core team collect the relevant data needed to determine the most appropriate incentive mechanism, there will be no mining rewards for testnet nodes. The blockchain component of the node will be open sourced. The Pi core team are in the process of tidying up the GitHub repository so that we can proceed with the open sourcing. They aim to maintain a list of open issues directly on the GitHub repository which community members will be able to contribute to if they like. Today we've covered the exciting new update from the Pi core team about the upcoming changes to the Pi Network blockchain's node system. As you know, the Pi Network is currently running on the main net, managed by only three nodes controlled by the Pi core team. However, this is about to change. With over 300,000 user-operated nodes running on the testnet, the team will soon begin selecting and approving eligible nodes to transition to the mainnet. This is a crucial step towards decentralizing the Pi Network's blockchain, ensuring that the system is genuinely decentralized and robust. If you found this update helpful, please give this video a thumbs up, share it with your fellow Pi pioneers, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Your support helps us bring you more updates on the Pi Network and its developments. Now, we want to hear from you. What do you think about the upcoming node transition to the mainnet? Do you have any questions or contributions about the Pi Network? Drop your thoughts in the comments section below. We love reading your feedback and we'll try to answer all your questions. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more exciting updates on the Pi Network.